Hi, this is Zef from Daho and I'm going to show you how to initialize this kind of access control from Dahua uh, the moment you get it. So uh, when you power it on for the first time, it will have this credential uh, by default the admin. Then you need to create a password and confirm the password. If you have an email, input the email so that you can do password recovery and then set the time zone. So to set the password, I'll press this button, press OK. Then I key in my password. You see there is a keyboard there. So I'll enter A. In this case, uh, I'm just doing a number, letter, key. Then I press this to change the keypad from uh, the alphabet to numerical. So I enter this. Then OK. Then I scroll down to confirm the password. After confirming the password, I say OK. I, I will ignore the email for now, but uh, you're supposed to set the time zone. So like here we are in plus three zero. Then I scroll back up to this checkbox. Okay, so now I have initialized my device. So how do I add a user? For example, uh, a user has a card like this, then I can, you see if I try, it will say unauthorized. So how do I make this card work? I'll scroll to this, then press okay, then go to the login of admin, then enter the password that I just created. Then, then press OK. Then go to user, new user. So the default ID is one. So I'll, I can change or maintain. Go to name, enter the name. Uh, so I've entered the name. I'll just use Zef. And then uh, enter fingerprint so I can roll a fingerprint by simply pressing OK when it's uh, selected the plus. Select. I press my fingerprint. It will detect, detect, and detect. Then successfully enroll. If I want to add another one, I just scroll to this one and press OK. Then press the other finger. Like that. Then once that is done, I go to card. So I press card, okay. I, this field is highlighted so I can add two cards. So I select this and then brush my card. Then press escape. After that, I have one card, one fingerprint. Then scroll down. The user type, it could be either admin or normal user. So I maintain user. Then the period. Uh, then the holiday plan, the default I leave, then the validity. So if you want this user for a short time, you can change the validity of that period. Then the type of user, it could be general, VIP, or any other. Then I just press OK, exit, and then it will prompt me to save, and then I press OK. Now, I want you to note this. The moment I now try to press my fingerprint, it's going to recognize this is there. Uh, the user who was enrolled. Let me try the card. So I have the card, it has access. So you can just easily and quickly set this up. Uh, so you can also make this user an admin by simply going to menu, login as admin. Now click OK, then I enter the password. Then I go to user. User list, I select this user by pressing down OK. Then I just change the user permission. I change the user permission to, uh, by pressing OK, it will change the user permission to admin and then escape and save. OK. So when I escape now, this user still has access. Uh, let me try fingerprint. Yeah, still has access. And when I want to log in now, I can log in 
by simply swiping the card instead of tapping the admin so that is how you just quickly do it from the interface but i would recommend also smart pss Lite, this software uh, or dss to easily manage the users and the devices so that is all thank you